arena just outside New York City, the United States faces a sterner test against Ecuador. Fans here excited, wondering if the United States can make it two wins out of two now. A defenseman against dangerous opposition who had a win in a World Cup qualifier against Venezuela. Yeah, a couple of players getting another look at us. Of course, it's good to have Anye back in this lineup after his injury. They need some steel in the defense. Somebody that can line up a Boca Negra. And we look at Ecuador right now and Castillo and Mendes in that midfield, Ian. That's going to be tough to tangle with. They've all come out and it's uh, half the atmosphere, United States in their smart red jerseys. Getting us out of the way here. And Altidore again in with a cross shot. Still might be a chance. And the goalkeeper Mangela grabs it at the second attempt. What a great start by the US. And number 11 shirt. And Montero takes him to Underlow. Dangerous play. Real burst of speed. And Steve Chirondolo, the confidence for Anya, will be one of the targets in the box today. Gets in nearly reached it. Ecuador got a free kick anyway. And here's the counter, they're good on the counter, they've got the pace as well. Michael Arroyo. And he's just waiting in the middle. Still Arroyo. And he's cut back and cut out by Andiego. Recently won the old Thorn Derby. Throw it was four two against Celtic. Now Dempsey on the volley! It was dipping, but it wasn't dipping quick enough. It's four against four. Valencia towards Benitez, and Onyewu did ever so well there. He made sure Benitez wasn't getting on the end of that. No way. Well, to see how that, that balance works here. Well, the cross is a poor one from Achilia. Oh, well, expected didn't really get it away. Gives another chance to Montero. This could be costly here. Benitez tried to attack it. And the US. And they kept it alive too. Jefferson Montero again, he looks at Ranger and finishes the shot past the far post. Beasley again. Better shot that time. His last goals for the US were three years ago tonight. More of a left back in the first half and pushing forward. And there's the cross and that's the goal. It's It. And he just went across the front, Tim Reed there marked up, he just gets a foot in there, and then you see that, the step to it, you can't let a player get across the front either. It's a shame too for the U.S. because they played so well. And the one thing that they'll always tell you is you keep the player in front of you and you've got an arm on him, at least you know where his run is, you've got to get your body in front of there and be stronger. Well, in terms of the defending, it's got to be better. It wasn't a great moment for Jim Ream on his uh, home field as well. Here he is now. And look at Oviedo now supporting the attack and playing as an auxiliary forward. Oh, look at that. Kept him alive. It's Dempsey. It's blocked. And he's into the side getting for a corner kick. And that's it. It's another defeat for Jürgen Klinsmann. That's three out of five. The bigger picture is molding aside for the World Cup qualifiers next summer. He would like to